than I thought it would. We're going up to my cabin on Mount Hood. My dad and I are going up right now because I wanted to like work up there for the day. And then my mom and sister are coming up tonight and meeting us. Dad, I just carried the dogs into the car so that their paws wouldn't get my car all dirty. I left Rory and I told her to stay and then I went back and I got Rue and Rory stayed. That's a isn't, isn't that so impressive? Yeah. All right, we're going to get Starbucks, but I'm gonna put my camera here because I wanna see what the dogs do while we're gone. <laughs> I'm running an experiment if they jump over. Babysit the dogs. Stay. Stay. The camera, I ran out of storage on my card, so it shut off, but I really hope you got, I got her climbing over it. When we walked in, she was sitting in the passenger seat. You're a naughty dog. Look at her, she looks guilty. She doesn't look as if she wants a piece of my thing. My dad did a bunch of remodeling, so I want to show you guys what he did because it's super cute. He did all of the, I don't know what this is called, but he like redid all these walls with wood and like the ceiling and stuff. And then he built this super cute bench for in here and then we got new floors for it. And then we're going to make this into like a room to hold all of our skis and stuff. So we're going to put like a ski rack up and like dog beds for in here and then into the main cabin. So we have like these two couches in here and then this red couch is the most comfortable couch on the planet and a cute little bookshelf. I think I showed this the last time we were up here, but this photo of my dad always cracks me up. Look at his freaking fedora, I can't. And then yeah, the kitchen's over there and the bathroom's in there, but I posted a vlog of us coming up here like towards the beginning of quarantine and I gave like more of a tour of things but it's not very big so there's not all that much to see. I love it, I'm so excited. I have like five Pinterest boards for what I wanna do at this place. So that's my mission while I'm up here for the next few days. I wanna like plan out the whole mud room. So if you have any ideas, leave them below for what we should do in there slash in here to be really cute. Begging. <laughs> what is she doing with her leg? She's holding it. You want a belly rub? You want a belly rub? Do get to ride! He's so happy! <laughs> oh no! Oh. <laughs> Oh, no. happen. <laughs> what happened? How did it spill? I don't know. Did I didn't you hit it. No, I didn't touch it. I think Dugan or Rory. Do do I think Rory's tail. It was, <laughs> it was Rory's fault. Dugan, careful! There's glass on the ground. Jamie's making fun of my outfit. It just is. I feel like I look normal. I mean, guys, look at my outfit. Like, You're saying we don't look cute. I do look a little bit like a boy. Whatever.
this is gonna be an experiment whether I'm able to go hiking by myself with the two of them because they both pull so hard. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to like hold on to both of them, but we'll see, let's go. going pretty well they actually have only pulled me over one time which I'm very surprised by like this is so pretty up here let's see how far we've gone so far so so far we've gone three and a half miles and I'm just testing out some trail running stuff I never have really like done it before and I totally don't have the appropriate shoes but I'm very curious about like whether I would like it or not because I tend to really like running i get really bored if i try running just like on a treadmill or whatever so i think that if i'm out on a trail i might like it a lot more i thought i would be dying a lot more because i haven't ran in like a few months but i'm really not i'm doing pretty well so yeah i think we're gonna turn around here pretty soon and then just go back because it's not a loop it's just an in and out <laughs> overall just very impressed that the dogs haven't killed me yet i actually attached them onto my backpack which is like kind of sketchy because if they did run after something I'd be screwed, but it's too hard to run with like holding their leashes in my hands. So hopefully I actually make it back alive and don't die. Mm -hmm. 